Florida estate litigation, does a Florida probate court have jurisdiction over non-Florida real estate? The answer is no, generally. My name is John Pinkowski. I'm a Florida probate attorney with the Pinkowski Law Firm in West Palm Beach. Our firm does not prepare estate plans or draft wills and trusts. We only handle disputes, trials, and appeals of probate litigation and related business and commercial litigation. So there seems to be a recurring issue in Florida estates and the administration of a probate here in Florida about what to do if you have a Florida estate but non-Florida real estate, non-Florida real property. Well, the answer is you need to open an ancillary administration in the county and the state where that non-Florida real estate is located. Why? Um, because um, a Florida probate court does not have jurisdiction over the real estate that lies outside of the state of Florida, right? In the Brown case, B-R-O-W-M, it's a July 15, 2015 appellate decision from Palm Beach's 4th District Court of Appeal. The 4th District Court of Appeal is Florida's appellate court for estate and trust matters and probate matters in Broward County, like Fort Lauderdale, um, and in Palm Beach County and Martin County, like Stewart, Florida. But regardless, the 4th DCA is good law in Florida, and you can use this and apply the concepts in the Brown case whether you're, doing, uh, whether you're handling an estate in Hillsborough County, like Tampa, St. Petersburg, Naples, Collier County, or Orlando, or Jacksonville, for that matter. So this was, was a Fourth District Court of Appeal opinion issued by Judge Jonathan Gerber last year, July 15, 2015. Um, and what the, what the Fourth District is saying is that our probate courts in Florida do not have jurisdiction over foreign real estate, real estate located outside the state of Florida. Let me give you some uh, cases that the Fourth District Court of Appeal used in its analysis and in this, in, in this Brown decision. The Polkowski case, 854 Southern 2nd, 286, a Fourth District Court of Appeal, a state case from 2013. The Pollock case, P-A-W-L-I-K, 545 Southern 2nd, 506. That's a Second District Court of Appeal uh, case involving in an estate. Um, Roberg's estate, 396 Southern 2nd, 235, a 1981 case. Um, so, like lines in the sand, state boundaries determine a court's jurisdiction over real property, and thus the Florida probate court lacked in rem jurisdiction to order partition and sale of foreign real property. So if you're involved in estate litigation in Florida or you have a Florida probate lawyer who is having trouble uh, distributing non-Florida real estate, um, many times you'll file a, an order or, excuse me, a motion seeking an order to partition the property, to sell it, or to distribute it. If it's non-Florida real estate, what the Brown case suggests is our Florida probate courts don't have jurisdiction to handle that matter. You need to open an ancillary. Does this increase... Um, Probate attorney's fees, yes. Does it uh, add time to the probate process? Yes, it does. Um, you, could get a, you, could, you may be able to get around those issues if the real estate were held in a trust or if there's jurisdiction over the trustee. But for the Brown case, um, it, it speaks to jurisdiction that Florida probate courts do not have jurisdiction to partition and sale, uh, sell a piece of real estate located outside of the Sunshine State. My name is John Pinkowski, and this concludes my remarks about Florida probate administration and non-Florida real estate.